Zeal Education Society, redefining excellence. Uh, good morning, ma'am. Our PBL group project topic is online parking booking system. I am Arshad Dange, and these are my group members. It's Shivraj Kumar Bhutte, Kailash Chaudhary, and Samruddhi Dhabade. So this project is guided by a respected professor Prajakta More. So I will start with the aim of the project. So aim of the project is the main aim of the project is to reduce the traffic in parking place. Normally we can see in multiplexes, cinema halls and large industries, function halls, there is problem. They have to go and search which line is empty and which line having a place to park the vehicle for parking. Then they need workers for parking in correct position. It is the money consumed process. So avoid this problem, digital parking system project is implemented. So I'm moving to the next slide is objective of the project. There are three objectives. First is introducing automatic vehicle parking system. So many countries to get benefited by it. Second is to compare various aspects of manual parking system with the automated parking system. And third objective is to find out economic benefits of introducing automated vehicle system. So moving to the next slide, the features of our project. So these are the features, the use the driver's information about parking spaces available, eliminate the hassle of circling a parking garage or area in search of parking spot. Help traffic flows because of less illegal parking, saves resources and time, uh, allow drivers to reserve parking slot before arrival and creates a way for further advancements and research in the sector. So moving to the next slide is module. It's um, Internet of Things, it's IoT. It is the combination of interrelated devices, which includes computer devices, microcontrollers, different types of sensors and machines, which are interconnected with each other over internet to platform perform a designated task with no human to computer interaction. Sensors and devices, connectivity, data processing and user interface. Uh, next slide is hardware requirements. Minimum 2 GB RAM, Arduino, you know, microcontroller, IR sensors, line cables and USB cable. Next slide. Arduino. Arduino boards are designed a variety of microprocessor and controllers. The boards are equipped with a set of digital and analog input and output pins that may interface to various expansion boards or breadboards and other circuits. The board features serial communications interfaces, including universal serial bus that is USB on some modules, which are also used for loading programs from personal computers. You can see the Arduino in this uh, diagram. Moving to the next slide, it's IR sensors. An IR sensor is basically a device which consists of a pair of an IR LED and a photodiode, which are collectively called a photocoupler and optocoupler. The IR LED eliminates IR radiation uh, reception or intensity of a reception of which by the photodiode detects the output of sensor. So now there are so many ways by which the radiation may or may not be able to reach the photodiode. You can see the IR sensor in the image. Moving to the next slide is software requirements. Windows operating system, MySQL, Apache, and Java. Moving to the next slide is system architecture. So you can see the system architecture diagram. So availability of parking slot detected through IR sensor, which are connected to Arduino microcontroller. The slots are indicated full or empty by red and green colors respectively. Moving to the next slide is applications, college, 
स्कूल्स बैंकिंग शॉपिंग कॉम्प्लेक्स सिनेमा कॉम्प्लेक्स एंड होटल्स मूविंग टू द लास्ट स्लाइड ऑन क्लन कंक्लूजन देर आर थ्री कंक्लूजन our project details the empty slots and helps to drivers to find parking space unfamiliar city uh, the average waiting time of user parking their vehicles is effectively reduced in the system second is the optimal solution is provided by proposed system where the most of vehicle find a free space free parking space successfully and last one is our preliminary test result shows that the performance of the arduino uno based system can effectively satisfy the needs and requirements of existing car parking has less there thereby minimizing the time consumed to find vacant parking lot and a real time information rendering thank you when vehicle enters into the parking slot ir sensor detects the vehicle and store the information in arduino microcontroller then arduino sends the information to the database which we have created then all the updates will get display on the website availability of the parking slots is detected through ir sensor which are connected to arduino microcontroller the slots are indicated full or empty by red and green colors respectively if car is not parked in the parking slot then it will display green color circle and if the car is parked in the parking slot then it will display red color circle 